The largest terrestrial astronomical observatory in the world is preparing for 2030. ALMA, the Atacama Large Millimeter Submillimeter Array, is upgrading its wideband sensitivity. This milestone will translate into an increase in the speed of spectral scanning by up to a factor of 50 for the highest spectral resolution. The observatory opened to astronomers in 2011. Located in the Chagnantor Plateau in the Atacama Desert in northern Chile, it has 66 radio wave antennas that work together as if they were a single telescope. The antennas were built in several locations around the world and assembled at ALMA's Operations Support Facility. The upgrade is part of the observatory's 2030 roadmap. So the main part of the ALMA 2030 roadmap is making the electronics of ALMA uh, a new generation so that they can have lower noise, so we can be more sensitive. They will also have higher bandwidth so that we can see more of the sky at different molecules. There are a lot of molecules in the sky that emit in radio. The array benefits from dry air and a thin atmosphere, conditions that allow it to observe the universe with greater precision than anywhere else. ALMA is at 5,000 meters high so that it can have a very low uh, humidity. That's what allows something like ALMA to exist in the world. And there is nowhere else in the world where this could be. It operates as part of a joint initiative of the European Southern Observatory, the US National Science Foundation and the National Institutes of Natural Science of Japan, in collaboration with Chile, the host country. The headquarters are in Santiago, where astronomers and administrative and technical staff support the team at the observatory. The Atacama Desert is home to top-level observatories. Its weather conditions, few clouds, little radio interference and almost absence of light pollution makes it one of the best places on Earth for astronomical observation. The array will continue working during its upgrade as the center heads towards 2030. Graciela Ibáñez, TRT World, Atacama Desert, Chile.